Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Journey to Wisdom and Wealth. My name is Tara. If you're new here, welcome. If you're not new here, welcome back. Grateful gang, gang, gang. Happy Friday, y'all. Happy Friday. If you like budgeting videos as well as this kind of video, which is updates on my um, first time home ownership journey, y'all getting everything. The good, the bad, the ugly, the wonderful all that. So today, it's so funny. I feel like all my updates come on Friday. I, I need to come up with a catchy tune name. I'm trying to give it to y'all live and direct. So I'm going to make this as short as possible. So if you're interested in that, y'all, just go ahead and give the video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And if you subscribe and not get a notification, don't forget to hit the notification bell. This probably won't be super edited, but it's going to be short. So maybe I'll do a little one, two, three. Y'all, update on the roadblock situation this morning. So I remember I told y'all last time, I'll link it up in the cards somewhere, if you didn't see it last time. And I was like, there is a job that I went on an interview for. And I didn't want to talk too much on it. You know, y'all know how that is. So um, I went on that one. Good vibes, great vibes. But I didn't, you know, you get group vibes from a lot of people and then it doesn't work out. Next, they did eventually call me back within like a week to be like, okay, I want you to meet up with the controller. The same accounts payable position. That's what I do if you don't know I'm an accounts payable. And <clears throat> excuse me, early morning. Um, she calls me back. And I meet up with the controller yesterday. That's Thursday. And, you know, I asked all my questions. Am I a good fit? What are you looking for? Um, do you have any questions for me? The general stuff. And he was like, you know, no, you seem to be well qualified, da, 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 this and that. Although I was a little worried because it was a video call, the second call. And the video call kept going in and out. Like, you, y'all, I put makeup on. <laughs> if you see my Instagram story, check me out on Instagram. You saw my Instagram story from yesterday. It was very lightweight makeup. Obviously, it was interview, um, but I did actually put makeup on, and then the video had the nerve to not be working. Sis, come on. That's okay, because I feel like sometimes I make weird facial expressions that probably was the best that they didn't see. So either way, the video wasn't working, but we did it because the audio was working, and they saw me for a little bit, and I had a little blazer, a little gray blazer on and whatnot, and a little tan, cute, all the way up to here type of shirt, um, moving right along. So that day i get something that says in the afternoon like we would like you to do a background check and a drug screen and i did not get excited yet because i'm like well maybe they're giving that to everybody as they choose their candidate so i fill out the paperwork for the background check and i went that day even though it was raining if you know me you know i don't like inclement weather driving girl i got in the core <laughs> I went to the Walmart Health Center because they gave you some options. That Walmart Health Center is clean and beautiful. And the people are so nice. Like, I was so shocked. Um, so I went there, did my um, drug screen test. You know, it's just a pee in the cup type of test. And they're very thorough. And then I came back home and I just, you know, honestly, y'all, I have been just thanking God. This right here has been my song the whole time. Let's hope I don't get copywritten. Yes, I'm grateful for the victory we won. Oh, 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 Y'all, I'm not a singer. Let's be very clear about that. But listen, God, I don't care. <laughs> uh, that has been my jam all week. Before I started the interview, during these interviews, y'all, I have been in tears. Okay, hopefully I didn't get no copyright for that. If I did, I'll put another video up. But so that was that. And I'm like, yeah, I'm giving my best friend because my best friend and my sister, I think, are the only people I've been giving updates to. Just trying to keep it on the low. You know, that move in silence move. And then this morning, y'all, I wake up and it says, so-and-so has sent you a document to review. Name of the document is offer letter. 
Jesus, Jesus, hallelujah, I mean Jesus, I mean nothing but Jesus, I mean, Je y'all, I have been looking for a job for like two weeks, three weeks, God is good, okay, I didn't even reach, I've applied on Indeed, and they reached out to me, and then it just been rolling, and the patience level I had to have, because they move slow in Georgia, but not the last couple of days though, so anyway, as y'all can see, I'm excited, <laughs> I got an offer letter. I will not get super excited until the drug tests and background tests come back free. Clearly, I'm not a drug user. I am also not a criminal, so I'm not really worried, but I like everything to be set in stone. Because if you knew from my Tara Gay Nicole channel what happened to me last time, <laughs> which is why I rushed and went and got the drug test, you would know why I'm a little skeptical, but I'm feeling good about this. Okay, so y'all, that's the update. I did get the job. Let me give you some quick more points so this video will not be longer than 10 minutes. It's more pay, not a huge amount more, <laughs> but it's more, come on Jesus. Um, there is, it is, some people are working from home right now and some people are working in the office. I would have to come into the office for at least the first three months for training purposes. And just, you know, I'm new. They don't want to just hand out their laptops and things to somebody they don't really know like that. And third of all, and third thing is, that might affect me because all the laptops and things you guys that I record on are actually the temp agency's company stuff. So huh, I have a really old laptop. I might have to see if I can get it up and running or else I might have to actually buy a laptop in order to continue doing my videos, except for the cash ones, which I do on my phone. Oh, because the screen sharing I need for the Google Sheets. So that's, I'm too excited to worry about that. I'm just like letting y'all know. So um, because I have to go into work, obviously, I will not be able to be on everybody's video immediately. So my weekends and evenings are probably going to be spent catching up on you guys' videos. So if you see me not commenting right away, don't worry. It's because I'm actually in an office now. Um, <sighs> um, also, it's a business casual dress place. So I feel like I'm going to have to buy some pants because <laughs> all I have really is jeans and I don't even know how much money I have in apparel because I wasn't really funding it with a lot. So we'll have to see what's going to happen there. Um, and I also need to let the agency know. See, in that letter they sent me, it just basically said that we're offering the job in contingent of the drug test and the background check and this is what you're getting paid this is where it's at and this and that however it didn't say anything about a start date so I sent them an email thanking them very much for accepting me and I was you know happy to be a part of the team and I'm excited to be there and that we need to iron out some details like the start date but I think I'm going to go ahead and call the agency today and let them know <laughs> that they need to start filling that position, but I don't know whether I'm giving them a week or two, but I just want to give them a heads up. I'm trying to be fair to everybody in this situation because I know it's a tough situation when you're leaving one and going to the other, especially right now, being that it's so close to the end of the month because it gets busy around that time. Anywho, that is where I'm at. Oh, this job has, I want to cry. I've been like half crying all morning. 401k with a match. Medical, dental, vision, PTO, PTO. You guys know when you're with a temp agency, you you take a day, you have to make it up in order to get paid. Like, we're not going to get into those negative vibes. Let's just be happy this job has so much more. That's it. That's the update for right now. Anything new or important that I get, I will let you know. My next steps is to kind of get the finalized letter and then send that to both the... Um, lenders that I'm considering and see what they say, whether I just need to work a month and get them four weeks of pay stubs and we can move forward or what's next. I'll let you guys know about that. Either way, you guys, it's Friday. And when I say it's a happy Friday, it's legit a happy Friday. Fry, yay. I'm having a great day. Something great is happening to me today. It did already. Something great is going to happen through me today. It's going to be a wonderful day. It's going to be a wonderful day. It's already a wonderful day. How's your day? Because my day's great. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Remember, in order to be great, you have to be grateful. And I'm super duper grateful for you. Have a wonderful, blessed day, you guys. Remember, faith over fear this year. What? Forever? Forever, ever. Bye. <laughs>